as we increase our internet use in the school system, I think it's critical that we find a way to provide affordable broadband access to all of our homes in our community. Uh, that's an area I think we're really uh, coming up short in as a nation. And uh, while we don't necessarily have to solve the nation's problems, I do think here in North Carolina we ought to be uh, lead the charge to, uh, to get affordable broadband access to all of our homes. Um, those kids who, who live in homes where there is a, uh, a broadband connection, the children are such an advantage when they come to school over those homes where kids don't have that access. It's just a critical issue, I think, for our state. Well, these days, you can, you can almost tell when children come into school whether, whether or not they live in homes where they have uh, internet access. Uh, the, the, just the use of the computers when they come in, the kids who, who uh, from very early ages have had internet access can already get online. There's all kinds of learning tools available that families have found and uh, the knowledge level that those children have coming into school is far superior to those families where they just don't have any access. Well, in our household, we're fortunate that we do have the internet connectivity and the high-speed internet. We have uh, three little boys, eight, five, and four, and even the four-year-old, uh, one of his favorite things is to get on the computer and be playing games. And again, we try to structure those games some and have educational games that he plays. Um, but a lot, I think about it, his four-year-old classmates in the preschool class, and many of them don't have that same advantage. So uh, the disparity between the haves and the have-nots goes, uh, goes exponential when you think about uh, a child who's already advantaged in many ways, this is just one more way that child's going to have further advantages over uh, a, ch a child of poverty. Well, I, I do think that the internet connectivity in our age is every bit as important as all those other services that we've come to expect is just routine, whether it's telephone, uh, just electricity, uh, just to compete in the global economy. Uh, other nations are finding ways to make this affordable to every citizen, and I think that's what we ought to do as a country, uh, and specifically here in North Carolina, I think our legislature should step up to that challenge and, and provide the resources necessary.